Okay, and we are back. What is up, everyone? Welcome back to the stream. It's me. It's MD Tenebris. I'm back again to bring you some more mediocre gaming. Below me on the screen, I have three links. There is a red link and a pink link. Those are two of my YouTube channels. If you like what you see today, feel free to go and check them out. I play Pokemon and I play Politopia, so that is that. There's also a purple link that is to my Twitch. It's where I am now. I'm here on Saturdays at 2 and on Wednesdays at 6.30. That's p.m. Eastern time. So if you want to come join the chat, talk to me live, hang out, that is the place to do it. There is also in the information box a link to a Discord channel. If you want to get me offline, talk to me about any of the games I play or anything in general, you can do it there. So today, there's so many interesting cards that I'm curious to play with. Fuck. Shall we try the future deck? Shall we try the 270? The 270 Iron Boulder? Let's try this shit out. Oh, it's a dark fire type deck. I wonder what Pokemon is going to be. Any guesses? Any guesses from the chats? What do we think? What do we think this dark fire style deck might be? Might not be dark fire. But according to the, the box and the coin, that's what they went for. You think it's going to be Charizard? No. No. What? Charizard? And we get the Iron Hand start. Fuck me. Fuck me. They got a mulligan. It's Charizard X. No way. No way. Two in a row. Oh my goodness. I don't believe it. I can't believe it. That's crazy. All right. So what do we have here? We can go future booster to retreat. We can go techno radar. We'll probably get rid of the bravery charm. Um, we can grab. I guess we want to grab Maridon. And, okay, I guess we want to grab Iron Boulder and, um, Iron Crown. And then on the next turn, we're going to judge them. Or on this turn, we'll see what they do. We'll see what they do, because I don't see a ton coming out. Um, so we're going to see. Save the judge for when we need to, um, use the Iron Boulder attack. Because you have to have the same number of cards in your hand, right? Alright. Pidgey and a bit of lots of draw coming through here for this deck. Lots of draw. Alright. We got an electric card. We're gonna go like this. We're gonna retreat here. We're gonna put the peak acceleration on. We're gonna go techno radar. I'm gonna get rid of the bravery charm. We're gonna go iron and uh iron. Here we go. Um, and I think I will put the future booster on because it's going to do 60 damage, 80 damage. I'm going to take out this Charmander. Ooh. Ooh. Lovely. So we take out the Charmander. We're going to go Psychic Electric here. We're going to go both of them onto this guy. There we go. Bada bing, bada boom. I forgot how clean these future decks were just in terms of efficiency. Oh, bang in. All right, so now we can go judge. Do I have any energy in here? We don't. So I can go judge. We'll remove their hand. We'll tie it up. Kind of want a boss's orders in for the Charmander, to be honest. <laughs> That'd be kind of mean, but we could do that. That'd be fine. Because they don't have the energy acceleration without it. And I get more energy, so I set my deck up a little more every time I do this. So we'll take out the second Charmander. No Charizard coming through. No energy acceleration. Um, I think we're going to go like this. This time. And we're going to put them on the Iron Hands here. We're going to prep this dude. And we get another prize card. There we go. And it's Psychic Energy. Fantastic. So we can just put a Psychic Energy on... To the Iron Hands. We'll be one energy away. That'd be great. That would be great. And then we can get to actually popping off. Yeah. Well, when you get the right cards in your hand, you know? That's the thing. He took out my Maridon, and we didn't have any draw. Um. So now I actually want to go... I actually want to go for the Iron Boulder here. We're going to go like this. This is not the better plan, but I just want to see how the deck works. This is how I, I wanted to use this card, so we're going to see. We got another Judge. Oh, fantastic.
Oh my god, I used the fucking cards. I used the fucking cards, so now I don't have the same number of cards in my hand as they do. Oh. Well, you live and you learn, huh? That was damn stupid of me. I just trolled myself. Ah, fuck, man. What a clown. I used the judge to fucking get what I wanted into my hand, and then I fucked up. Classic. Classic MD. <laughs> Misplaying the deck like a bum. Um, That's alright, though. We're gonna see how many cards they finish with. Um, I hope it's three. If they use another card, actually, I'll be fine. I can use whatever card I get. So we're just gonna not use a card. Grass energy, that's fine. 190 damage. That's pretty sweet. That's pretty sweet. And the judge is also like a semi-control aspect. Um, So that's pretty good. What do we have here? Nothing. Can't use the tulip. They've got four as well, though. Oof. So we might need to use the judge. This is, uh, this is gonna be an interesting deck to work with, this Iron Boulder card. Having to match your opponent is gonna be tricky, especially if it's, like, just the Iono later on. Because it's, like, three to six, I can't make up the cards. Um, and if I have more cards than they do, prize cards, and I use the Iono, and I actually can't use them, like, I don't get energies or I don't get Pokemon I could put down, then I'll be kind of stuck. Rare Candy coming in, Pidgeot EX, there it is. Pidgeot EX is weak to Iron Hands, but um, I need to get the Iron Hands into position. It would only do 240 damage as well. So it would not get the knockout. They're down to three, though, so I could put this Grass Energy on the Iron Hands. Um, we're going to see what we get. We might have to judge. What's the card? Techno Radar. So I think we put the Grass Energy onto the Iron Hand, so that's all ready to go. And I think we play... Hmm. I mean, I could go Techno Radar and just get rid of the Tulip, I guess. Or I could get rid of the Iono and then just not... Oh, no, I could go like this. I can grab one Iron Crown. I could put it on my bench like that and then we have the same number of cards and I'm doing an extra 10 damage I mean extra 20 not bad I know Iron Hands is electric but he's he's only doing 100 uh, he's only doing 240 damage because it only does 140 like I would have to use I guess I could use the arm press for the one hit KO I could have done that. Oh, true, 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 true. I do have the Iron Crown. So it would have been 140 times 2. You're right. You're right. I didn't do the math. I didn't have the energy to retreat. This guy doesn't have the future booster capsule, though. I I had to put the last energy onto the, the Iron Hands to get the Ampu very much to work. So I would have had to use the Arm Press um, at the end of the day. Hmm. That's alright, because we can use the Maridon, and we can grab two more energies. We can put them on the Iron Boulder. We can do 80 damage. I'm not too concerned. Maybe we can find a, a boss's orders or something. This is the first time I'm playing with this deck. Like, give me a break. Like, I'm not going to be the fucking best there ever was. This is, like, second game with this deck. It's the second game with this deck. We'll see what they're going for. If if my opponent also wants to fuck me over, they could use an Iono. Have they gone yet? They have not used I don't think they I don't think they used that this turn. But maybe they did. Ooh, what does this do? Five forty, fuck me. 
So I could just get another iron iron boulder already. We'll do we'll do um a hundred damage, I believe. Go like this. We can save the judge. Electric energy. Hmm. <laughs> Hmm. Hang on, we have the tulip. Um. So we'll go tulip. All right, and we got the judge. I don't know what that supporter card does, so we're going to have to see. I think we need to boss up Pidgeot and take three prizes with hands next turn. I mean, I got to get the bosses, right? But if I get boss, that's all good. I don't even need to use the iron hand. I mean, oh, yeah, because the iron ampy very much will get us um, the extra prize card. They still have to take five. Like, that's kind of the benefit of this deck is, like, I'm using single prizes for a lot of these guys. But we'll see. They might just have a boss's orders here. They might go for the iron crown. Um, it would be very typical Charizard X. What does this do? Draw a card for each of your opponent's bench Pokemon. That's pretty nice. Not gonna help when I judge you. <laughs> we're gonna see. If we get the boss's orders, obviously we're not gonna judge. But if we do get the judge... I mean, uh, if we don't get the boss's orders with the draw, then we will just use the judge. And neither of these guys have a, um... So I'll play this guy. We'll play this one up. Because I don't have the future booster capsule for the free retreat. So I'll have to put the electric energy onto there. And we didn't get it. Um... Hmm. I mean, I wouldn't be able to go anyway, so we'll go judge here. We got the future booster capsule and the boss's order, so we are in a great place. Um, we're doing 210. It's almost enough. It's almost enough. Um, damn. If I go Earthen Vessel Beach Court, then I only get two price, two energy cards back. So I still can't play it. That's tough. That's a tough break. So close. So, so, so close. If I if I had another card, I could have gone Earthen Vessel, and I could have gotten the energy. Um, no, because using Earthen Vessel will always only replace two cards for two cards. Three prizes next turn. That is true. Unless they do something like Iono. I don't know what they're doing with this. Maybe they'll go for the boss for the Iron Hands because it's worth more. Um, they can one-shot it now with this guy, because obviously three prize cards. Charizard EX is a stupid broken card. The more prize cards you have, the stronger it is. I would hope they go for the Iron Crown, though, because it has the double damage, and it has the, um, it's, it's worth two prize cards as well, but we'll see what they do. We will see what they do. That was close. I almost got the knockout on that. I was so close to getting the knockout. I just needed fucking 20 more damage. I needed one more Iron Crowns on the bench. Or I needed the Future Booster Capsule, but I couldn't play the Future Booster Capsule and do the damage that I wanted to do. So we'll see. They've played Arvin, no Iono coming through. We should have this in the bag. This should be a win. This should be a win. I'm very excited to get my first win with Iron Boulder. This is a, this is a crazy looking deck. So we're gonna go Iron Hands here now. Shit, I can just hit this guy. I can just hit the Charizard EX. I don't even need the bosses. We get the three anyways. There you go. Thank you for the game. Fantastic. Aren't I a genius? For including Iron Hands in this deck. Aren't I just such a genius? 
<laughs> Thank you for the suggestion. It was a great suggestion. <laughs> do I want to go first? Yes, I would like to go first. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. Fuck. Oh, I want to go second. Why am I so bad at this game? Tragedy strikes. All right, we're going to go Iron Boulder here. Oof, man. That's that's a painful error. And it is, in fact, the Kingdra. Tough deck to beat. This is a tough one. Very concerning. All right. God, I can't believe I did that again. It's not like I have any supporter cards. But I'm so annoyed at myself for doing that. I'm so used to playing decks that require evolution. So it's just like... Oh, man. All right. All right. Return. turn. Three Psychic Energies. Not great. Gonna end the turn there. So we have five cards in hand. They have six. They have seven now. You gotta see. They now have six. Hmm. This might be tough. I might not be able to play a card if they don't get rid of enough. Um, fortunately, we have a lot of tools, so we can get this hand down pretty nicely. They're playing a lady. Absolutely not. We're screwed. They're going to have a ton of energy in their hand. Ten cards. Oh, man. I need to find an Iono or something. This is tough. What are they going for? Tails. Nah. Shit. All right. Is it Cedra? Cedra. All right. So I might not even be able to attack this turn. I hope I find Maridon. If I find Maridon, we're good. Nope. Um. Tough break. Okay. We got zero damage coming in. <laughs> Fuck. Oh, man. Tough deck. Ten cards. How am I going to get it? I need to find an Iono. Do I really need this? Probably not. I don't think I've used a Tulip once. Search for three Pokemon. This is similar to the Kingdra. <clears throat> Put them in your hand. That's super nice. Mm. Wait, does the Kingdra put them on the bench? I think it might. They went for the Sharp File instead. Earthen Vessel here. Can't do anything. Can't do anything. Um... I'm gonna get rid of this tulip. This is not looking good. Oh, goodness. Not looking good. I am not doing well today. Here comes the Kingdra. And is it just put three water Pokemon from your discard pile on the bench? All right, they got to be in your discard pile. So he's taking this guy out. He is weak to electric. But that doesn't matter because this guy is only going to do 240 damage. I am up Shit's Creek without a paddle right now. Sure, why not? Why not? Um. Okay. Damn, man. Getting bad starting hands. I need a Maridon in here. I need a Techno Bracelet. I need something. We got two Professor's Research, three Iono, and four Judge, or two Iono and four Judge. And we have zero draw available to us. You gotta love it. Absolutely. And he's up to 250. This game's over. Holy shit, man. That sucks. If I get a Techno Bracelet and I can grab two Crown, that's what, 160 times two? Not gonna happen, though. Not gonna happen. All right. Oh, we got 360. Hell is yes! Yes! We're still in it! God, we're still in it, man. Grab two. Let's see. Judge! Okay. Not great. That's all right. We can do Ampu very much. This guy's weak as well. We might have the win here. They have a rare candy. I might be in a little trouble. Oh, shit. Oh. 
So they only have the one energy attached. Buddy Buddy Poffin coming through. This is tough. This is a tough one. We're going to see. Damn, man. We need to put... I can't put the Bravery Charm on. They can't do damage yet, though. Oh! But they don't have the Backscalibur in play yet. Um, We're going to go like this. We're going to go Judge. Yeah. Ooh, we got boss's orders. Oh, we might have won there. We might have it. Oh, wait. 320? Because of the crown. Oh, perfect. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Ooh, if we lucked out against the water deck, that's what we need. There's so much luck involved in this game. Oh, my gosh. We're pulling it out. Ah, oh, man. It's tense. It's so tense. So they have to have a rare candy and a backscalibur in here. There they go. They got the rare candy in the back Excalibur. Are they going to have enough water energy? If all four of those are water energy, they have enough. If all four of those are water energy, they have enough. If one of these is an earthen vessel. Mm. Mm. Did we win it? We won it! Oh no, the comeback! The absolute comeback! Oh, it's brutal. It's brutal. I don't need to do anything. Yes! Yes! Oh man, after I was just singing the praises for Kingdra EX as well. Sorry, had to take you down. Can't be losing three games in a row. Can't be doing that. No way. Oh, thousand damage. Amp you very much. Fantastic. Okay, so that is going to be it from me today. I hope that everyone that came along for the stream had a good time. I had a very good time. This was a very fun stream. A lot of surprises coming through on the stream itself. Very cool set. I'm very excited to play with a bunch of the cards in this Terrapagos EX edition, the Stellar Crown. Looks really fun. Looks really cool. Three energy costs. Kind of exciting. So we're going to see how it goes. And this deck, this deck is pretty sweet. Um, I'm always a big fan of the future decks. I think they're very strong. Um, they synergize very well. They have a lot of Pokemon that you can put into them, which is pretty cool. So this is pretty good. And 170 for two energy, if you can get that set up with the Judge, that's really insane. Um, you honestly don't even need to play as many cards as I played in there. But um, that's how it works. That's Future Deck. That's a lot of stuff. So below me on the stream, I, below me on the screen, I have two links. There is a red link that is to my YouTube channel, MD to Never's Place Pokemon. If you like what you saw today, feel free to go and check it out. The pink link is to my YouTube channel, MD to Never Place Polytopia. If you are interested in Polytopia, you can feel free to go and check that out. Got some tier lists coming up soon. Um, yeah, you can like, you can subscribe. If you click the bell, it will let you know when there are new videos available. The purple link is to my Twitch. That's where I am now. I'm here on Saturdays at 2 and on Wednesdays at 6.30. So if you want to come join the stream, talk to me in the chat, hang out, help me build the decks, make fun of me for my stupid plays, that's the place to do it. There's also in the information box a link to a Discord channel. If you want to get me offline, talk to me about either the games I play or anything in general. You can do it there. So I'd like to thank everyone that came along for the stream today. And you, the viewer at home, if you're watching this on Twitch or on YouTube after the facts, thank you very much. I hope you're enjoying the content and I appreciate the support. So if you want to drop a follow or subscribe or like, it's totally your choice. I'd like to, uh, yeah, wherever you are in the world, I hope you have a wonderful rest of your evening. I hope you get a fantastic night's sleep. Just a very peachy night's sleep tonight. Very well rested. And you wake up hungry and healthy and happy and ready to take on tomorrow. That is going to be it from me today. This is MD Tenebris. I'm signing off. So take it easy. Peace out. And adios. Thanks. Have a good one.